Put my mic into uh -oh. it. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So I just wanted to call a house meeting real quick because obviously talk talked to Josh. Um, he's doing this campaigning. Uh -huh. And I think it's just better to just air everything out as a house instead of individually talking one at a time and telling people different things, maybe the same things, maybe things that are true, false. I just want to, I'm a straight shooter, so I just want to know straight up, okay? So, first thing, like, my name has been thrown out by a lot of people, okay? If you've thrown out my name directly and you wanted me on the block this week, can you raise your hand? I said it as a pawn. Okay. I did say that. Okay. Awesome. But, but I said it like as a pawn, like if you want somebody to go home, right. your best bet is to put him next to Jed because no one is going to say Jed's name. Right. And that can be confirmed. That's what I said. Sweet. Okay. Perfect. Um, okay. What else? And I'll also say like I spoke to Kyle and Roe about the idea of me not wanting to be against Roe and saying... Maybe I should talk to Austin about putting up a strong player. You said it to me too. I said to you in the kitchen, uh, I said, do you want to talk? And then you said yes. And then I thought about it and I was like, I'm not going to sway anything. No, you did no say I said it. to you. You did say I it. I said to you, no, I did not. Do I think you should put up a big physical threat this week? Totally. No, I said it would be cool to see your claws come out, but I'm not going to say, I didn't say a single name to you. Okay, yeah, credible, when there's only credible. three people, it doesn't So, like, you if you say physical it. threat, like, who are you talking about, though? I mean, you're not on the block, so obviously you know where I stand Right, on this. exactly. Yeah. So, like, by, saying, by telling me that, like, Austin is gunning for me... Well, that, when I spoke to Austin and I went through my pros and cons of everybody, when I said your pros and cons, she did say, we don't have the votes to get him out yet. Did you? I did not. Yeah, I don't you talk did. game with you, Josh, because no one believes anything you no, say. No, it was in the pros and cons conversation. You straight you up said those words. You only gave me cons words. really for yourself. I gave you pros you gave and cons, me for, cons everybody. for everybody. Your thing was big physical threat. I'm like, yeah, don't think he would go this week. And you're like, that's true. You said He's, we don't have the numbers yet. Well, obviously. <laughs> okay. You're not on the block yeah. two times from me. And then right. can we also way. air out uh, Ro coming up to me and saying I should win in the VO POV competition and then we can backdoor Jed? Okay, <laughs> <laughs> what, what, what is it? Are we, Where are the lies? Are we not? <laughs> straight hold on, though. Hold on. Hold and on. then Josh, I chose Tina yeah. to Josh, play again. Yeah. Josh, are we Pretty Boys 2.0 or me, Ro, going after Jed? Which one? No, which one is it? I, I'm not saying. Like, you no, said but which those one? words which to one? me. What are you talking about? And then I Why said, would I Let's... want you to win the POV? Sure. Pardon? Why would I want you to win the POV? No, use for you to play in the POV. Josh, you've thrown us under the bus five times. And Why the fuck Jed would we want to, to keep you in the game? Okay, if I said that to you, then you had house guest choice. Why didn't you pick me to play in the POV? Because that's that not happen? what I wanted to do. <laughs> I what? chose yeah. Tina. There's a T. Then you would have just picked me if I was going to take you down off the block. Or me. <laughs> I chose Tina because I'm feeling alone in the game, so I just want to win for myself. Well, but if Rose going to backdoor Jed, why statements. would you not pick him? Yeah, why wouldn't you just pick me then? If I was going to backdoor Jed, take you off. That's a great question. Well, because you brought it up in the night, and then we didn't talk about it, and then in the morning I said, do you want to talk about what you brought up last night? You said, not yet, and then we got pulled into choosing the POV. This makes some sense. I just, I just, I don't know if this makes sense to anybody else. Then he would have just picked me as house guest choice. Yeah, that makes sense. I, but I didn't want to do that, so I didn't choose you as house guest choice. Then why even bring it up? Why would you bring that up in conversation then? Like, why would you tell because people that Because you're trying I to pin you everything up? against me. Obviously, I'm, everybody knows worst case scenario for me would be Josh coming off the block, right? No, if you won POV, got and took me off, you're also safe. No, well, why would I want to do that? Why would I win POV, take you off the block when you've excluded yourself from the entire house, then, okay, you and I stay, but then next week, I'm going on the block because I took you off the block. Why would I do something like that to myself? It just doesn't make sense, right? Because there are alliances forming and you want to start taking out other players. Just which, like there so was tell, alliances forming day hold on, three. Tell us, tell us which alliances are forming then. Which, just call them all out because you obviously know where all the alliances are. because You're, you're too group. smart for this game. Just call them all out then. Because it no. just doesn't make sense what you're saying. They conflict. Okay. The only thing I really want to know is like with the Pretty Boys 2.0. I don't think that's a thing. Okay. But, I, that was, but so who brought it up? Who thought of it first? 
uh, I asked Austin if she was seeing it too, and she said yes. I was in the room. That didn't happen. Yeah. That did not happen. She was literally. In the she room. came into the room after Three you and I. Three seconds into no, our conversation, you and, I were talking. and you said. I saw you and Jeff, I were talking. Joe and Kyle no, sitting the outside, plan was, and it sounds like a pretty boys 2.0. You said I'm starting and to I see said, it too. And I said, yeah, that makes Beth sense. Came, no, and then our plan. And then Beth you came were going to go said the talk same thing to, to Beth. Brayden and Beth. That was not what? the plan. That was the plan. Josh. Austin. This is endless lies. Okay. Literally, you were in the room, and he said the exact same thing to you. Did he not? I, well, I asked you because I said, oh, we might as well ask Beth right now. And then you asked her, but you are the one who are coming up with this thing, and no one else believed it. So did she thank you when you didn't throw her under the bus for coming up with it? Yeah. I did not come yeah, up with did. it. Yeah, you did. I did not. No, come we up were with sitting it. there when I was going through pros and cons, and I said I didn't say your name when that whole thing came out, and you thanked me for it. You I, thanked me for it. I did not. And you're say looking me in the eyes and say you didn't. Listen, like, Josh. When you said, oh, I never brought up your name in terms of talking to people, I said, that's cool, thanks. Nothing about the Pretty Boys 2.0. That was all you, and you know it. I, you know it. You were in the conversation with me. You called me in to try to spin more of your lies. Beth came in two minutes later. You told her the exact same thing. The thing and you we came had and you spoken told about. The, same the thing. thing we had spoken about, Austin. What thing? Why are you on the block, then, if we're so tight? Oh. <laughs> because you want me gone because... <laughs> I'm the easiest person to put on the block. Yeah. I'm the obvious outcast in this house. Because okay. you're doing and it to yourself, happen? though. And how did that I know. Happen? I had a meltdown. Like, I will fully acknowledge that. And the fact that I comforted you and I told you, I hope people see where you're coming from in terms of that, and you're turning around doing this, that's slimy. Well, yeah. Who else? That's Everyone slimy. wants to know where everyone's head's at. You're the only person that I could go after. You put me up on the block. This so is a game. That's blatantly lie. Blatantly. What? Okay. So if you, you were to stay, to if you were to stay, it would be Austin. Yeah. Like you'd be gunning for her. Yes. And who else? I would ask the house who they think is the best pawn to go up against Austin. Sorry, why would you be going after Austin? Because I'm on the block because, because of her. Because she put you up. That's the only reason. Mm. And because she let me take the entire fall. For the pretty I boy I did not create any of that. That was all you. No, Josh. you let me take the entire fall. And you I deserve the entire the, fall. I started the conversation with did you. Did I and go you to continued. anyone else and say anything about Pretty Boy? It all happened on. very fast. Did I say fast. anything? No, Julie's the one that told me. Same, Julie. Julie's the one that yeah. told me as well. Yeah. Mm. Let me think. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you got to use two fingers. There you go. <laughs> you were in the room. That came in seconds later. You had the I same conversation with her. You, do. you were in the room. And if the pretty boys are a thing, and I, I actually conjured are. that up, but it's pretty. Then people. why why wouldn't one of them be on the block? Why? That one makes of them no is sense. on the block. Well, Only yeah, because one of them out. Nominees. But it's pretty convenient that once nobody believed pretty boys, then you try to turn it internally against each other. Two now Ro is trying to get out Jed. House. Nobody believes that Ro and Jed are working together. So now Rose is trying to get out Jed. Because what he did is he created this big picture of Pretty Boys 2.0, and he figured out that's not going to work. So what he's trying to do now is make Pretty Boys 2.0 go at each if other, that's because what? that's his only feasible plan that he stays. And if I create it, why wouldn't Obviously. I put you two up on the block from the beginning? And she could have exa exactly. She or why would you just put him up as a replacement? Or she to could, split the house. Or she could have just put up Jed as a replacement exactly. nominee. Yeah. And that's what I'm saying. And said, and guys, remember exactly that thing I conjured up? Let's get him out. Yeah, like the only reason I don't believe you is because, like, you told me that multiple people have said my name many times. So technically, she would have the numbers to get me out this week. Absolutely. Josh, have I ever said Jed's name to you? No. Nice. So, Kyle, you have not said Jed's name. But he to me. just told me that you did. No, you were in the room when I, Ro and I had the conversation. That was my thought of like going against a big person. First of all, it wasn't a conversation. It was you talking. Okay. It wasn't. A, I wouldn't call that a conversation. Okay. You know what I mean? So I was in the room when Rose said he wants to pull you off the block and to block. No, 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 not that conversation. That was alone in the room. And I just told Jed that outside. I said Josh came up to me and he said he's going to go up to Austin and try to get you on the block. That's exactly what you said but in that you did conversation. That, you did that before, and then I never went up to Austin and had that conversation. No, Austin, Austin just said Austin you tossed his name. You, right before the ceremony, you told her to put me on the block. I did not come up to you and say put Didn't Jed you on the block. Okay. at the beginning that okay. you said that you were scared to you, go against Rose so if you don't put think Jed? he's forward and I'll potentially talk Is it not you said at the very beginning? It's very easy to go four against one here. 
And if you guys honestly think that one person working alone have had one conversation since literally laying low, everybody in this house knows I said, I'm laying low, I'm not having any conversations since well, I don't know what day it is. But it is one conversation, but the only issue with that one conversation... You're the only person I've spoken to. Right, but to in, within that conversation... You spoke to yeah, Vic. So many yeah, names were brought up, you know? Mm -hmm. So it's just like, just, just it'd be stupid of though. me to not air it out. That, no, if, I appreciate if, you if airing it out. there's eight people targeting me, I need to know. Yeah. And I'm going to ask everybody right to their face. You honestly don't think people see you I as think a I think people see game. me as a target, but I think there's a time and a place, and I don't think that they're gunning for me right now. I don't, I'm gunning for everybody. This is a one-winner game. Everyone's Everybody, everyone. everybody's a target. Everyone's yeah. a target. But if I hear that people are directly saying, let's get Jed right now, let's get Jed right now, after I've had meaningful conversations with people, mm -hmm. then that is a blatant yeah. lie in my face. So that's okay. what I want to know. I'd rather, like Ty well, says, tell me straight up. So okay. if that's the case, I want to air it out with everybody. If you Clearly no one says that they have said my name right now. My name's going to be said eventually. Yeah. But I just wanted to air that out because our one conversation literally pinned me against everyone. So I just want to know if that was a lie or not. Because if I know that people that I... It did I, not pin you against everyone. There was like a lot of names of people that... No. Like the boys are just being cool to you because they're manipulating you. Yeah, I think that's true. So you did... So did he look like someone that we could manipulate? I mean, like, I, it just doesn't... Uh, Josh, it just doesn't so I did say up. his name or I didn't see you? Because you, you just told me I didn't. Name. Well, you just no, agreed I did. I said you were in the room. He asked me if Kyle was in the room. Yeah, but you, he just asked you if me and Ro, the boys said that we we're just playing him to manipulate him and you just answered yes uh, five minutes ago no, you just said, told me i'd never I said his some name people are playing into okay so you, you think again it's your thinking how good did that work out for pretty boys 2.0 i just want to know if it's like true or not like the stuff you're saying about literally bro coming up to these me. four right here being in an alliance i don't know i me. said i don't no, well, that's he made what it's another alliance, like. pretty boys. Now this is another alliance, so I'm sure you guys are all in an alliance. Like no. everyone's in an alliance. Thanks. Well, and also I just come, I just keep coming back to this I point. If we four were in an alliance, Jed would be on the block right now. Like why wouldn't you? Yeah, like, be why would you put her own alliance member on the block? Why would uh, I depends when it formed. Why would I? Why would she put her own alliance member on the block? And maybe there's is a this speculation home. again, or is you have stuff? Is it straight speculation? Yeah. yeah, like, what are you basing it off of? Like, uh, the, what are like, your facts? I did like, not what say 100% to you, Jed. I said I noticed them hanging out more. <laughs> but we're all hanging out with each Dude, other. Dude, we had a seven-game series of pool, and we were hanging out over there, and there's an alliance there. We have because a conversation, and, and there's an alliance today, there. I've talked with Tara. I've talked with Tina. I've talked with Who Latoya. I've talked with Beth. Do I don't we talk have to an alliance now? <laughs> I, I hate her, but like, I still talk yeah, to her. I don't talk to Ro. Do we ever. have an alliance now because I, I hung out with them for 15 minutes in Expedia? How do you like, say that? What, where's the logic coming from? Oh, I'm scared to go up against Jed. I or I'm scared to go up against Rob. Yeah, I get the game. I get the game. Like, you're playing the game. I'm just having. I'm just being nice to everybody, talking about personal lives. Like my conversations are not even entirely about game. Like I'm just trying to find out more about people, like where they're from, also, like their family. It was also your birthday like yesterday. It was my birthday yesterday. <laughs> like I'm just fucking talking. It's, it's also weird to me, Josh. Like this morning when I was doing whatever in the bathroom, you said you were gonna do something. I said do whatever you want. It's your game. And you said don't worry. I'll keep. I'll keep your name out of it. Was that not your exact? He words? asked me if you I were said do in whatever room, you want, and I said yes. That's all I said about you. But now I'm in another alliance. I didn't ask if he's in the room. I didn't know if he's in the room. No, you asked me. No, no, I said, Kyle did you there? talk? No, I said, did you talk to Kyle? And I said, he was in the Kyle room. Kyle had said, that no, I didn't. Had spoken I said, in the Kyle OLG was room. in the room. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. But you said that he agreed with what was being said. Which was no, me. I didn't. Yes, you did. No, I didn't. So, so, when, so when when it was me talking, and then, then I realized no, that it was what he said. not a feasible thought. So, who was in the room? It was me, Ro, and Kyle. So, was Ro saying my name? Not in that conversation. The conversation of him thinking to backdoor you was in the bedroom. I thought there was the only bedroom. one convo. I'm so confused. So what is the convo you had with them two in the OLG room? That was pre-nominations. About? That was me saying, I don't want to go up against you, Ro. This, I, is, this is what happened. He pulled Kyle and I into OLG. I was already in there. Or, yeah, he, Kyle was already in there. He's like, I want to talk to you and Kyle. I was like, about what? Okay. He's just like, just come in, let's talk. And he talked the entire time. I didn't say a word. Kyle didn't say a word. And he's like, I'm going to go up to Austin, and I'm going to pitch that she put up this big physical threat. I did not say and he made it very threat. obvious that it was you that he was talking about. You said I make a big move, and yeah. there's only two other people other than Roe that it could yeah. be. And so I, Three other people. 
I didn't say anything in that conversation. I was just like, do whatever you want to do. But then I went to Austin and we had a conversation about me going on the block and I never even told Austin to put you on the block. I just mm -hmm. said, yeah, okay, if you want to put me on the block, you feel safe with that, you go ahead and do it. Mm -hmm. I'll take one for the team. Mm -hmm. That is the exact conversation. And anyone can ask Austin that. And, and I told you as well, thing. I said, I wouldn't want to mm -hmm. risk putting someone like Jed up because he is a big physical guy. I don't want there to be any potential for that. So let's do yeah. this. Exactly. And I didn't even push back on Austin. I was just like. He's like, got it, totally. Yeah. So. So that's exactly what happened. I don't know what he's talking okay. about with this other conversation with him. Okay. That's the game you want to play? Okay. What you, dude, you can't criticize my game. I mean, look what you've done to yourself. You've, you've exiled yourself. You're on an island right now because of what you did on day three, and you're doing it again on day 11. You're telling all these lies. You're getting tangled in this web because none of the lies okay. add up. You know what I mean? If you're okay. going to tell, tell lies, if you want to put Austin or myself under the bus, you can do that, but make sure they all connect at the end of the day. Mm -hmm. And that would make you smarter than everybody else in here. I do not think I'm smarter than everybody else in here. Oh. Didn't you say that to someone? <laughs> no, I said I think I'm very smart. <laughs> like, I, and I think I said I'm too smart like, and think too many things. Like, that's so, what I said. <laughs> well, that wouldn't make any sense then, would it? No, it, like, I go on a lot of different, like, thoughts. Well, then you could process your thoughts before they come out of your mouth then, right? If you were smart. That's true. Right. So, like, what is the main reason, like, what would, what would benefit the house with you staying over row? Because we know that there's going to be individual conversations going on over the next day. Mm. And, like, I just don't want it to be hopping from lie to lie to lie to lie. So, like, is there something that you can say that is like a clear point as to why Roe should go instead of you? Other than like pinning us all against him? He's a better player than me. So how are you gonna get me out? But like, how is he, like you even asked me, like you said, Great question. you said at the, end of the, at the end of the game, if it was me and you, would you be me? Or if it was you and Ro, me and Roe, would I be Roe? <laughs> I rate, if you, if you, stay this week, you would beat me. That's not true. You have done more than I have. You flipped the house twice. What the fuck has Roe done? He's playing a very good social game. How is he playing a good social game? You're just talking to people. He's on the block. That's the social game. He's on the block. I'm He's on, on the block. block. There's two the other block. people. There's minimal people. There's two other people. Yeah, obviously, like, LaToya and Brayden are not on the block right now. Jed's Brayden not on the block right now. Brayden is her best friend. That's a good social Look, game, isn't it? LaToya. He's developed a good relationship. Made, like, also like what, just being, there's no justification okay. for what you're saying right now. Okay. If, I'm playing, if I'm playing the best social game, then how am I one of four people that just happen to end up on the block as a replacement? Also, why is she put up her alliance member? And why would she That's put up I her alliance understand. member? And if we were in an alliance trying to get him out specifically, why not just do it right now? Okay. But, why, but no, seriously, why would she put up an alliance member in your mind? Instead of getting my target out. Instead of out. getting her target out. I don't think he was a target this week. I think I was a target You're making week. it very but clear But why put up her alliance member to piss him off? Hmm? Why put up her alliance member and piss off her alliance member? I Makes no sense. Okay. Alright guys, I think we got it. Let's stop grilling him. We got it. Okay, that's let's what you guys him. think. Let's leave him alone. I think we understand. It's like, if that's what y'all think, that's fine. Let's no, I'm, I'm not even grilling you. I'm just asking why would someone put up an alliance member? If that's what you... Okay. No answer? Okay. okay. Yeah, but it's just it's consensus. Josh, I think you're going home this week. There's, you know, we don't all need to sit here and grill him. Yeah, okay. That's fine, yeah. I just wanted to clarify a few points. Because, mm -hmm. like, obviously, mm -hmm. like, you know, I'm on the black next to him, so I need to, like, make sure this all comes out. You're clear on everything. Okay. And you are clear on everything, because that's mm -hmm. important, too. Okay. Cool. Yeah, Mike. All right. Thank you. Class adjourned. Oh, sorry. Appreciate it. Okay. Oh, sorry.